Elsewhere in the factory, wicker is being produced. We start with large rolls of paper developed specifically for our needs. After slitting to the proper width, the paper is loaded onto a machine and drawn through a glue mixture before spinning it into cord and winding it onto the spools. The cord is then rewound from the small spools to these large ones that then will be used by the loom itself. Each roll is loaded onto a number of racks that feed each loom. The loom draws cord from every roll simultaneously to weave the wicker fabric. The horizontal pieces of fabric, called stakes, are made sturdier by the addition of internal aluminum wire. Here they are being fed by the stake feeder into the loom to be interwoven with the regular paper cord. Here the Ewer loom, which uses a different process of weaving than the Lloyd loom, weaves a stout paper stake fabric to be used as tabletops. The loom fabric is then sealed completely by submerging it in a latex bath, ensuring it withstands the elements of the outdoors. The loom fabric is then dried before it goes on the large spools and then can be transported to the cutting room. 